Welcome to Foundation Math Club. Today we are going to learn multiplying numbers near base 10, 100 and 1000. These numbers are our base because we will be taking examples that are going to be near 10, 100 and 1000. Let me take the first example that is 12 times 14. The base in this case is 10 because these numbers are near 10. Now the first step says how far from base. So 10 plus 2 gives us 12 and 10 plus 4 gives us 14. Okay, we are done with step 1. The second step says cross add one pair. So we have to cross and add a pair. Now we could add any pair. We could either add 12 plus 4 or 14 plus 2. In either case the answer will be equal to 16. So let's just write it over 60. Okay. The third step says multiply. What are we supposed to multiply? We are supposed to multiply 2 and 4. What is 2 times 4? It is equal to 8. So we will just write down 8 here. Now the third step is done. But a very important thing in the third step is the number of digits that we get in the third step will be equal to the number of zeros in the base. So in our case, it is 10 over here. So 10 has how many zeros? One zero. So the last digit over here or the product which we get in the third step should have one digit. Now let's take an example where we get a carryover. Now I'm going to take 14 times 15. First step says how far? So 10 plus 4 gives us 14. 10 plus 5 gives us 15. The second step was cross over and add what is 14 plus 5 it is equal to 19 if you observe 15 plus 4 also gives us 19 so let me just write down 19 and the third step was multiply so what is 4 times 5 it is 20 now base in this case is 10 number of zeros is 1 so I can put over here only one digit Whereas I have a 20 over here. So what we do is we write 0 and we carry over 2 to the digit on the left. So let me write 0 here. Carry over 2 to the digit on the left. In this case it is 9. So let's just add them up. 0, 9 plus 2 gives us 11, 1. Carry over 1, just about 1. 1 plus 1 gives us 2. So the product is 210. Now, let's take the next example where the base is 100. Let us take 99 times 98. Okay, how far from the base? 100 minus 1 gives us 99 and 100 minus 2 gives us 98. Cross and add. So, what is 99 minus 2 or 98 minus 1? It is 97 multiply what is minus 1 times minus 2 it is 2 now number of zeros in 100 2 so the last step should give us two digits but we got only two so what do we do we just write down two here fill this place up with zero so our product is 9702 let's take one more example 93 times 95. How far from the base? 100 minus 7 gives us 93 and 100 minus 5 gives us 95. Cross and add. So let me just do this. 95 minus 7 gives us 88. Multiply. Minus 7 into minus 5 gives us 35. Since the base is 100, I should have two digits here in the third step and I got 35. So, our answer is this, 8,835. Okay, moving on. Let's take an example. Uh, let's say 102 times 103. Over here, how far from the base? 100 plus 2 gives us 102 and 100 plus 3 gives us 103. So, we have taken uh, numbers greater than our base. Okay. Second step, 
cross and add. So 102 plus, 100, uh, plus 3 is equal to 105. Third step, multiply. 2 times 3 equal to 6. Now, base is 100, 2 digits I need to get. So we got 6, so I write 6 over here and put a 0 over here. So the answer is this. Now let's take numbers where the base is 1000. Okay, base is equal to 1000. Let's take 998 times 997. Okay, how far from the base 998 is? 1000 minus 2 gives me 998 and 1000 minus 3 gives 997. Okay, first step over, cross and add the second step. This gives us 995. 998 minus 3 gives us 995. Third step, multiply. Minus 2 times minus 3 gives us 6. So how many digits do I need here? The number of zeros. 1, 2, 3. So 1, 2, 3. So we write 6 and we fill it up with zeros, the remaining places. So this is our product. Now let's see one more example. Let's take something greater than our brace. 1002 times 1005. How far from the base? 1000 plus 2 gives us 1002. And 1000 plus 5 gives us 1005. Okay, we are done with the first step. That is how far from the base. Next step was cross and add. So this gives us 1007. Now, Next step, multiply. 2 times 5 gives us 10. Number of uh, places that has to be filled up, 3 because 1000 has 3 zeros. So 10 here takes up 2 places. The rest we will fill it up with 0. So this is our product. So easy. Quite simple, right? Thank you.